Hey, Ingrid. Hey, it's Nate. Again. Wasn't sure if you got my voicemails or texts or... Oh, sorry. Sorry. Oh, it's cool. No, I just... I'm not into the whole hand-holding thing, so... You're gonna hurt yourself. You know, I, I know I'm a woman, but I've lifted heavy weight before. No, it's just 100 pounds. You know, when men challenge me, I usually win. <laughs> Must have drank too much last night. How much do you want me to leave on? Um, none, I think. Let's do none. So, you remember last night? Sure. You liked it, right? Shh. What? Well, I'm not ready to be publicly straight or whatever. Nobody cares. What about you? Did you like last night? Yeah, it was fun. I never arm wrestled naked before. Yeah, that was fun, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, I felt a little bit like Jodie Foster. <laughs> What's that mean? You know when she's in a movie and she kisses a guy, it kind of feels like incest. So last night was like incest? <sighs> yeah, I guess. Sorry. It's just after last night, I realized that I don't really want to have sex with you. I just sort of want to be you, you know, in your body looking out to the world. Like a trans. No, oh, God. No, I'm just like, a, I'm like a straight guy. So basically last night I was having gay sex, which is disgusting. <laughs> I've had sex with a man, it's not disgusting. Are you gay? Maybe I'm bisexual. No, 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 women can be bisexual. Men who sleep with guys are just closeted gays. So what are you? You know what, I'm, um, I'm actually done. We've only been here 15 minutes. Travis, you can't tell me what to do, okay? It's sexist. <sighs> hey, listen. Yeah, this isn't working out. Yeah. Wait, you agree? I don't want to be your experiment, you know? I don't want to be your experiment, Travis. You can't turn me, okay? You can't just force the gay out of me. I mean, not that I'm gay. My heterosexuality has to be coaxed out. Ingrid, I'm really not into you that much. What? I mean, the sex is okay, but you don't really know what you're doing. I know what I'm doing. With women, maybe, but with men, I don't know. It's just not that good. I get it. You're homophobic. I, I understand. You don't like gay people. No, I, I've heard it before. I hear it all the time. It's like I'm evolving on the subject. Totally understandable. Whatever you say. Cool. Cool. All right. All right. I hope you figure yourself out. I hope you figure yourself out, too. Hey, Ingrid. Hey, it's Nate. Again. Wasn't sure if you got my voicemails or texts or... Oh, yeah, I left a note on your door. Uh, maybe it fell off or blew away. and The weather's been so crazy, you know. Anyway, uh, I miss seeing you. Feels like it's been forever. <laughs> <sighs> so call me if you want to grab a coffee or, uh, or take a trip. <laughs> You know, seriously, though, I have some vacation time saved up, so let me know if, where you'd like to go and when, and uh, and we'll plan something amazing. You can call me anytime. 
or text if you don't like the phone or, or, or email me if you don't like the text or, you know, hey, if you don't have internet, I can meet tonight at Sun and Bloom. I'm a vegan too now. <laughs> I took the plunge. Yeah, so if that was a problem, uh, shouldn't be anymore. Um, all right. Well, uh, I love you. There. Wow, I said it. I said it. I love you. I, you, you, you don't have to say it back. I just, uh, you know, no pressure. I just, I just had to get it off my chest because it had been driving me crazy. <laughs> okay. I hope you're good. Bye. Okay. Bye.